Hello and welcome back to Prison Architect. We are back here on Mayhem Prison and let's take a quick look over here. 23, well treated. 23, serious complaints. 23 is the magic number right there. But it looks like uh, we're okay for now. It is increasing so that's not good. Let's see. Food and I guess that's the biggest thing. Where are we on our day? Alright, so they're going to have dinner soon enough. So let's put this on the fastest setting, and I believe we have to go ahead and finish up the rest of the rooms over here. So let's go ahead and do that. Clone. We need to clone this right now. Right now, right here. Let's clone. So there we go, we have everything planned out, so they're installing everything. We had to make a minor modification over here because if we do go into the utilities, as you can see, we have our metal detector here, and we have another metal detector here, and uh, if we have this coming across over here, these two cables are going to connect, which is not good, which I don't want, so I routed that up here, it'll connect these metal detectors, and it should be good to go in that case. So hopefully that works out. We'll just have to wait and see. And of course there's garbage blocking that way. And we're going to just lock that open regardless. So they're going to be busy installing that stuff. We just have to wait until everything's connected. Then we'll get power back in this room. And apparently we have a guy sitting inside a locker. Interesting. So what else should we do? We gotta get the little staff room up. I wanna get that up. And we gotta get more of the pathway done as well. So I guess once we're finished this area, we'll go ahead and finish up the pathways as well. Uh, let's go ahead and lock this open. There we go. We're good to go. It looks like we're good to go. Power's there. Let's take a look. Utilities. Uh, everything's connected. Yep, looks good. Looks good. Just gotta wait for these metal detectors to be installed, and he's doing a little dance before installing it. Alright, that's good. Alright, there we go. We got we got a cash flow of 1,172 so far. Are there any more prisoners arriving? Uh, it looks like it. I'm pretty sure we have to wait until these guys uh, come in for their cash flow to actually increase, or is that not the case? Got more prisoners as well. So I think it was 26 altogether, right? If I remember correctly. We may have to expand this area. We may have to expand it. I'm not quite sure. I might as well just uh, extend the deliveries down to this area over here. I mean, there's not a big issue or anything. So let's go ahead and do that. Deliveries. I'm just not too sure how the kitchen's going to do. We may have to expand the kitchen somehow. Might have to push the kitchen down, push this down, and move this around as well. Not quite sure yet. If we want to push the kitchen down a little bit more, expand it, we're going to have to decide to do that soon. I don't think we need any extra guards. Maybe I'll hire a couple extra guards. Staff. Guards. There we go, we got apparently 11 guys floating around. Maybe I should hire a couple more uh, arm guards just for rotation purposes. Currently debating on which area of the prison I should develop next. Well, I gotta get the pathways done, that's for sure. So, concrete tile. So, let's get this part done at least. All right. 
Alright, so let's get rid of this planning for now. We don't need this planning anymore. It's all done here. Alright, so not too bad right now. So I think we can go ahead and start working on the staff room over here. So exhausted staff members around this area and whatnot could come into this room and just relax. Or maybe I'll turn this into a clean cover and put the staff room down here. That would make the most sense. So people in this general area will go down here and people in this general area will go up here. Yeah, I think I'll turn this into the staff room and then this will be the clean cupboard depending on whether uh, I could hire, I don't know, at least 10 people into this little room. Uh, I'll keep it this size. If not, then I'll have to expand it a little bit bigger. And lumber, no, we don't have to sell the lumber yet. So let's go ahead and build this room over here. This will be the staff room. So we do require the staff door. There we go. And how's everything else looking over here? The needs. Sleep is down. That's good. Hygiene's going up. Well, that's for the morning shower, so we're good on that. Uh, everything else seems pretty good. Recreation is getting a little bit high, but that's fine. They got lots of free time throughout the day to do their things. Bladder bowels will hold it. Better not pee on the floor again. I think that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I like it. Let's go ahead and label this now. So where is the staff room? There we go. So what are we missing? Oh, we got everything. Perfect. Excellent. So we have a nice staff room there for the staff who gets tired in this area. They can just go right in there and relax a little bit. Good to go. Good to go. I think this regime is working out fairly nicely. Everything is staying relatively low. You know, there's a little bit uh, of criticals here and there, but that's not too bad. Not enough to get all the prisoners into a frenzy, so that is good. And, of course, let's remember we just got another intake, correct? 27. We will definitely close this up for now. Uh, someone brought in a gun. It is day 30, so we will do a shakedown. Let us close that up for now, though, and uh, let's do the shakedown right now. Might as well. Actually, I think we'll do it at night time. Uh, um, let's see. Yeah, we'll do it at night after they eat. Uh, we'll do it right around at 10 p.m. Yard is holding up fine. I may want to get the clean cupboard up and running now so we have more prisoners at work. And do we have any that are qualified to work at the workshop yet? I don't think so. I mean, how's this looking? Contraband. Demand, none. So that's good at least. Uh, programs. So we have these. They're interested. So why don't you go and do it? Why don't you go and do it? Huh? There's three interested here. So maybe uh, they'll get that, maybe they'll do that when the, they feel like it, I don't know. I'm not quite sure when they'll get on with that, but I guess we'll just have to wait. And then, let's get this up actually. So over here, I want to put some nice grass for the dogs. That's cool. See anything funky? Look at them. Snazzy with all them tasers. Alright, so it is free time. We'll go ahead and let them use the washrooms and the other facilities that they wish to use for the time being. But then, we will do a shakedown. So let's go ahead and do that right now.
any incidents. It does not look like it. So we pretty much searched uh, almost all the places. A couple more now. Where's the last places they're searching? Oh, I guess they're done regardless. So let's go ahead and take a look at our contraband. And in the last 24 hours. Alright, it's not too bad. How about all time for our expansion of this wing over here? So we'll build up this wing and then we'll build up that small area, then the final area. And then after we're completed all that, we're going to go ahead back and get all the floors done. As you can see, I laid out uh, basic strips over here where I will put uh, various floorings to make it look a little bit better. And I will be putting the ceramic tiles and things like that in these rooms as well make it look all nice so penalties unsolved mystery ninety thousand dollars serious injuries two thousand dollars all right well time without incident 719 hours so far so that is good i say but that is it for now so i just want to say thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoyed and of course until next time i will see you guys later